Hi guys, welcome back to the Cocktail Vlog. I'm Steve the Bartender and today I'm going to show you how to make a yellow smash. So the smash style of cocktail derives from the julep family of cocktails um, and now they've kind of blended into to one cocktail family being julep and smashes. Um, I'll leave a little bit more detail in the description below so you can read about the different styles or different cocktail families that there are. Um, julep smashes, sours, uh, bitter drinks, highballs, what have you. Um, yeah, follow the link in the description below to find out a little bit more detail. So Harry Johnson was the first one to refer to a smash uh, in one of his cocktail books back in 1888. And the yellow smash was first created at Golden Bar in Munich. It's a typical smash. Um, a smash is basically a sour with the addition of fresh herbs to kind of elevate the drink and add some color and add more flavor to the drink. Let's get straight onto the drink and it calls for well, yellow smash, yellow chartreuse, kind of makes sense. So 60 mil, two ounces, add that straight into your cocktail shaker. And we're gonna follow that up with some fresh lime juice. Pre-squeezed, make sure you use fresh lime. None of this bottled store-bought stuff. So 30 mil, one ounce, add that straight in. And this recipe calls for a dash of dry curacao. So I'm going to add a big dash. And I wouldn't normally serve it like this when I was serving at a bar or to a customer, to a patron, but I'm making it for myself. A dash of simple syrup, one to one simple syrup, and then add 10 mint leaves. Make sure you use nice fresh mint like this. I know in a couple of videos in the past I've used some mint that's been sitting in the fridge for a little bit too long. Add the mint straight into your cocktail shaker, fill it with ice and then give it a shake for 12 seconds. Now fill your double old fashioned glass with ice and strain over the top. If you want to, if you prefer, you can double strain it, but I like those little mint leaves. I like that extra flavor in the drink. I do think those little, it can be a little bit annoying drinking those little mint particles, but like the basil smash, I like the basil leaves inside the drink. So I think that's kind of a crucial part, completely up to you. Makes it kind of rustic as well. And then simple garnish, big sprig of mint, and there you have a yellow smash. Definitely get those those sweet herbal notes, which is just like yellow, yellow chartreuse to a tea. The mint plays so nicely with the yellow chartreuse. It's rich, it's intense. It's really, really good, absolutely delicious and probably my one of my favorite smash recipes to be honest i probably prefer this over a whiskey smash so make sure you give it a try thanks for watching make sure you like and subscribe and i'll see you soon for another cocktail video cheers